could we extend the sun's lifetime? Absolutely, at least in theory. Our sun sits happily on the main sequence, steadily fusing hydrogen to helium in its core. But over billions of years that helium builds up, heating the core and making fusion run even faster. This shortens the sun's life, eventually pushing into a bloated red giant phase that could swallow Earth. Our sun is somewhat convective, and smaller stars even more so, meaning they churn their contents over time rather than leaving everything concentrated in the core. One way to slow this clock is star lifting, using powerful magnetic fields or targeted heating to pull material off the sun's surface. We could then filter out the helium and heavier elements, the metals, that actually accelerate fusion and drop the hydrogen back in, effectively cycling out the waste that ages the star. That waste is incredibly valuable too, representing thousands of plants worth of heavier elements. You can return the hydrogen you pulled off right back into the sun or bring in fresh supplies from elsewhere. In fact, simply removing excess helium will let the sun live far longer, and with large hydrogen stockpiles gathered from around the galaxy, perhaps even indefinitely. It is a colossal engineering task, but one well within the reach of future civilizations climbing the Kardashev scale, looking to preserve its home star and home planet for untold eons. For a deeper dive into star lifting, stellar refueling, and even reviving dead stars like white dwarfs or neutron stars, check out our full episode, Refueling Our Sun, 